Lego City, the greatest city in the world. The city where I became a cop, which is how this story begins. That's Chief Gleason. She runs the police department. She's tough, but fair. And that is Deputy Dunby. He's tough, but unfair. What are you doing, McCain? No, oh, uh, nothing. End of Chase McCain's blog, part one. So how are you settling in, Chase? Great, thanks, Chief. I finished all my training and I'm ready for duty. Excellent. We're all very happy to have you here. Aren't we, Deputy Dumby? Thrilled. Well, I'll leave you with the deputy. I'm sure he has some important work for you. I certainly do, ma'am. <laughs> We're out of donuts. Get me some more. Yes, sir. Part two. I think I've made a bad career choice. Enjoy your stay in prison. <laughs> I'll be out in no time. You wish. Masterminding those car thefts is the last crime you'll do for a long time. <laughs> you know he just stole your pants, right? Whoa! Remember, find out what they're planning, and stop it from happening. Gotcha. Here's the prisoner. Thanks. I'll take him from here. See ya, Dunby! You fool. <laughs> Dunby really thought you were a guard? <laughs> that idiot! There you go, friend. What's going on? Let's just say you shouldn't bother unpacking. Because we're all breaking out of here today, thanks to the big boss. <laughs> <laughs> huh. I might be a little bit late. <laughs> Among the escapees were five of Albatross Prison's worst criminals. Phew, it's a good thing none of the really competent ones got out. This is Natalia Kowalski reporting for LEGO City News. You really think Rex Fury is behind this? Who's Rex Fury, sir? None of your beeswax. It's adult business. I am an adult. All right. Rex Fury is a dangerous criminal behind a string of robberies. Except we can't prove it, because he always commits crimes in disguise. Where did they come from? I think Rex broke out those criminals for some greater plan. Which is why I want you to investigate a theft at the docks, which I believe is connected. We're on our way, ma'am. Excellent. Whoa. Uh, hey! I saw you on the TV. It's Natalia, right? I'm Officer Chase McCain. Hello, Chase. It's nice to see the police so quick to respond. We're busy trying to round up the escaped criminals. Oh, yeah. I bet there are a few red faces at the station. No, just yellow. So, what's been stolen? Everything! And I think they stole our foreman, too. Unless he still stuck up that crane. Don't worry, citizen. I'll find your missing equipment and beloved boss. Did you get that on camera? What I don't understand... ...is anything. <laughs> ...is why they wanted construction materials. Maybe they just wanted to stop the bridge repairs? So no one could get over it to Fort Meadows. Well then, you should go and investigate Fort Meadows, McCain. Thank you, sir. I'm sure it's full of wild geese you can chase. <laughs> I'm certainly not sending you to keep you out of my hair. Of course not, sir. 
You don't have any hair. Yeah, I... What? Hey! Hello? Is anyone there? I'm a police officer. Ow! Ooh, my head. Sorry. Uh, no, it's fine. I'm so glad a policeman is here. There's been a... Uh, strange rash robberies today. Yes, there are criminals here. Uh, I mean, that's terrible. But don't worry, I'm here now. McCain's evidence is nothing of this sort. It's the same kind of ID card that they use on Apollo Island. The place where they build space rockets? So what? That's weird. I can't get through to them. That's simply a coincidence. Sirs, ma'am, a patrol boat was just sunk near Apollo Island. And that's clearly just, uh, eh, uh, fine. Right. I'm gonna need a volunteer to parachute down to Apollo Island. Good man. This might be useful. Hey, Chase! They're flying the reporter back to the station. Right. Thanks, Dad. Don't worry. I got the guy that did this to you. That isn't him. You heard her. You're free to go. This other guy that was it this man maybe except he wasn't wearing a mask <gasps> is this him I meant <gasps> is this him yes one moment I don't want to panic Natalia but if she can identify Rex then she is in grave danger take her to Bluebell Woods she should be safe at the sheriff's station. Understood. Good news! We're going on holiday! Hmm... So, the chief really thinks I'm in danger? Yes, but don't worry. You'll be safe here. Uh, once they open... Come on. You can keep me safe while we kill some time. got a lot done in 20 seconds. Officer, am I glad to see you. We've got a situation. Okay, what is it? Another criminal arrested. I am unbeatable today. Oh, really? Ow. Rex Fury. I don't know who you're talking about. <laughs> now, if you'll excuse me, 
I gotta tie up some loose ends. If you touch Natalia, so help me. She's still around? I thought I froze her solid. Oops. Thanks, man. Thanks a lot. Hey, I bet you stashed her at the sheriff's station. Stop! You idiot, Chase! Thanks. I'm glad Rex used standard police handcuffs. I'm not. I checked at the sheriff's station. He grabbed Natalia. And it was my fault. Yes. We'll deal with your mistake later. But first, we need to find out what his plan is before he blows anything up. Whoa! Hey! Or just after. Someone just blew up the donut bakery. Okay, this is now officially an emergency, people! Plus City Hall and the uh, fire department. Everyone go. I'll coordinate things from here. <laughs> Give up, Rex. You failed. I don't know the meaning of the word failed. Right, gotcha. Well, a poor education would account for your life of crime. I had wonderful teachers! Ah! Ooh, I, ow! Don't! Oh! Remember! My spleen! The ah, bank! Oh! Having! Ah! Uh, this! Ooh, many! Ah, steps! My pancreas! Whoa, 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 whoa. Come here, I'm gonna catch you and, and be very ill. Let's finish this. if you know where Rex Fury is. <clears throat> Never mind. <laughs> well, that should be a feather in my cap. Now, uh, make sure you get my good side. Oh, hey, Deputy Dunby. Good news. Natalia Kowalski's agreed to testify against Rex, but shh, sh it's a secret. This isn't live, is it? Oh, Chase! Deputy Dunby, uh, why am I here? Because we need to talk, McCain. Come on, this way. I've got good news and bad news. Firstly, Chief Gleason is giving you a promotion to detective. What? Really? Wow. What's the bad news? That was the bad news! There's no way you deserve a promotion after the mess you've made! We had to put that Kowalski woman into witness protection! Really? Oh, Natalia. Hang on. Then what's the good news? To save the department any further embarrassment, I talked them into transferring you! To where? The other side of the world! <laughs> bon voyage! Wait! No! What if Rex Fury escapes again? Hmm. Nah. I mean, what are the chances of that happening?